hello guys welcome to solving solutions on brand channel where i get solutions to all your solving problems it's nice having you in class again today how have you been on today's tutorial we are going to show you how to simplify um vector using arcgis pro right good so we have done similar tasks using qgis however on today's tutorial we are going to use what the arcgis pro to carry out um, that tax as well so we are still using the administrative boundary of um, river state and then ensure that your data set is in a projected coordinate reference system because it is actually very very important right good so okay we can decide to take this out so ensure that your data set is in a what in your projected crs so um we want to before we start show you the vertices so to achieve that we come to edit and then um, under the edit we can decide to okay select the object we want to edit which is this right good and then possibly what we click on edit vertices now you can see the different vertices have been highlighted right good so each of these vertices are actually having their coordinates so you can see the list of coordinates and then you can see it in what in meters right our eastern and our northern so if we decide to scroll down we have about 768 points which is translated to 768 word vertices so in some operations you might not be able to use this polygon because um, the number of vertices are too much right good so what we want to achieve is that we want to reduce or simplify as the case may be the number of vertices without distorting the, the shape itself right good so okay let's um, clear our selection and then we can decide to close the modify feature so we search for what sorry let's come to geo processing now we can search for what um, simplify so um, let's use this simplify polygon option okay let's um float it right good so let's use this information here it simplifies polygon features by removing relatively extraneous vertices while preserving essential shape right good as it has stated relatively what extraneous vertices while preserving what essential shape because that is actually what we need we don't want to remove the vertices and then at the end of the day we don't have our shape again so our input feature will definitely be what the boundary of river state we are using and then the output feature class has been automatically indicated we are going to leave it at that now for the simplification algorithm we have different algorithms right good retain critical points it retains bends you know retains weighted effective area and then it retains what effective areas right good so these are the different algorithms remember you can always use what the information by the side to actually read what each of them means right good so for the tolerance we told you that um, the higher the tolerance value the better the simplification but the caveat is that you might actually lose or yeah have more distortion right good so to achieve that you need to create what a balance so let's use um 50 and then our units is what in meters right good because we told you that um, we are using um, a projected crs right good so we can decide to run good so we have a success report we can decide to dock this back and then um, okay it returned the point as well right good let's take that out and then let's zoom this to layer first good so this is what the simplified polygon right good as against what the initial polygon that we imputed so before we leave let us now confirm the number of vertices that um, we have for the simplified polygon so since we are still under the edit toolbar we can just um, select which is this simplified polygon right good then um, we click on edit vertices right good so we now have this table that shows us what the number of vertices right good so if we still scroll down we are going to see about 491 as against the 700 and um, 
60 something or 30 something that we had earlier which shows us that the number of vertices has been what has been reduced right good so that is actually the essence of what using the the simplify tool yes to actually simplify this polygon that we have here right good because it has reduced the number of relatively extraneous vertices while still preserving what our essential shape right so if you look closely you might not really see much of a distortion in our shape however the number of vertices has been has been reduced when you get to this stage and then you can proceed with whatever analysis you want to do with what your data set right good so so thanks for coming to class we hope we have provided solution to this particular js problem we are going to see you on the next tutorial ensure you keep staying safe and have a very good time bye